Hello, how are you? I have here the Homka Cervical Memory Foam Pillow here that was sent to me to review. I'm really excited about this one. I'm not gonna lie, I love to sleep. <laughs> not that I'm lazy, I just, I enjoy my sleep. Uh, so this here, it looks really cool. So this is what the box looks like. Slow rebound, three to five seconds, slow rebound, absorb impact force and reduce pressure. Thermal characteristics, sensing body temperature to provide matching support. I like that. 3D curved design. Contour design perfectly supports and aligns the head, neck, shoulder, and back. Has a washable pillowcase. And something that really, that I really like about this, it accommodates all your sleep styles, whether you sleep on your back, um, whether you sleep on your side, whether you sleep on your stomach. I do all of the above, probably within like the same hour, like I'm just a turn. <laughs> There's some tips here and it says because the pillow is a compressed package, it will normally rebound to normal within 24 hours after opening it. So we'll go ahead and open it right now. And I'm not going to post this video probably for another week or two because I really want to test it out and I will show clips of that as well. Um, but we're going to start with opening the box. So let's do that. And it does look like it is available in white, gray, or black. Looks like we have white here. So pulling it out of the box. Got some weight to it here. I don't know how many times I've bought a pillow that comes with a manual. <laughs> how to clean the pillowcases. It shows you pictures in case you don't know how, how to sleep. I'm just kidding. <laughs> well, this is nice. I do like this section here. Obviously the pillow is not gonna have those, <laughs> those colors on it, but it kind of shows you what area is for what. All right, let's go ahead. I'm excited to open this and check it out. Ooh. All right, so we open this. Oh, I can already feel it starting to like, ooh, like there it goes. <laughs> it's like, I'm free, I'm free. Okay. It's like watching bread rise. <laughs> okay, so we'll continue to let that do its thing. I am somebody, like I've bought a lot of different pillows. And I've wasted money on a bunch of different pillows because pillows are just one of those things you just, you don't know until like you have it in your bed and you try it out. So there is a zipper here. So what's on here already must be um, the pillowcase that's washable. So you can take um, this part off and wash this outer pillowcase. Okay, so here we don't have, like I said, those fancy colors to show you. Look so modern, like a spaceship. <laughs> so you can see here the dip for your neck and it kind of dips back down for your head. I'm excited. Um, and then your arms can like come up. I'll be interested to see if that's comfortable for me. I know like when I sleep on my side, I don't know what I do with my arms. But these are made so your arm like has a little resting spot right in there. All right, so first impressions out of the box. I I'm impressed. Um, <laughs> I can't wait to try it out, see how well I sleep. So that'll be next. Hello, I am back to give you my review of this Homeka memory foam pillow. I do really like it. So I've been using it uh, four and a half nights now. I say a half because... <laughs> I figured I might as well get my husband's, you know, get a second opinion. So one night I let him use it and I went back to my old pillow. <laughs> when he got up in the middle of the night, I took it back. <laughs> so I think in the intro, I was kind of laughing. I'm like, who needs a manual um, for a pillow? But after the first night, I did find myself going back to this, just um, making sure, like, am I using it right? What are all the different ways you can use it? Um, so the first way, obviously, is on your back. Um, and it does show that picture there. Um, you can do whatever you want, like with your arms, but, uh, there it is. 
Oh, you can see the pillow coming back up. So the night that I let my husband use it, he was insistent on putting an extra pillowcase like over top of it. I'm like, no, no, no. I'm like, it, this is the pillowcase. Um, and he's like, no, you're going to get it dirty. He's like, look, you already got a spot on it. And yeah, like I did, but <laughs> he put a pillowcase on it. I'm like, you've lost access to your arm wing things now. Um, anyway, so I took the pillowcase back off. Uh, so you know, this is pretty comfy like this. At the end of the video, I will take the pillowcase off to show you the inside. I was a little worried, um, like where it dips down where your head is. You'll see it actually like there's a hole in the middle. So there's like this little hole where there's like nothing and there's like this little button. And I was like, oh, like, am I going to feel? Oh, well, you can see the button on the, the pillowcase there. I'm like, oh, am I going to like feel that? Never once did I feel that. Now I am a roller. I, I sleep on my back. I sleep on my side. I sleep on my stomach. So I did test all of the ways. So it says for this, you can also uh, sleep on your back and flip it around the other way. Um, it says for sleeping on your back, you can um, turn it around as well and put your neck over the back there. So do that. And that's pretty comfy as well. So you have those two different options um, if you are a back sleeper side sleeping okay <laughs> so sleeping on your side if you look at the picture here so she's on her side and she's got her arm like in that side wing there i call them wings i don't know what the right name is i tried that so we sleep on our side so she's got this hand, you know, here next to her face. And then her other arm is like this. The issue I found with that was like gravity. <laughs> Cause it kind of like, you know, angles out. I don't know, like I just, I felt like, unless I put something else there and I, I did actually have my little Bambi pillow wedge, wedge it in there, you know, it'll stay and that is pretty comfortable. Um, but I had a little bit of trouble, like, with my arms staying there. I wanted to, like, keep falling out. But for the side sleeping, um, even though the picture shows her head in the middle, on this picture, let's revisit this here with the different colors. That blue part, it says side sleep area. This big, chunky memory foam part. Um... Well, and this kind of goes with sleeping on your, your stomach, too. So maybe I'll, I'll go ahead into that. Uh, for the stomach sleeping, it shows her, again, with her head, like, right in the middle. I have horrible allergies, and I'm having the worst time breathing through my nose at night. So there's no... When I put my head in the middle, like, it, it's, you know, it sinks down into that hole... And I got like half of my mouth and half of my nose is exposed and it's not enough air. <laughs> but this chunky part here with the memory foam, I found myself sleeping like this a lot. Where I'm right on this big piece of memory foam, arm up through here. <sighs> I slept a lot like that. <laughs> And I found that to be, like, super comfy. I don't know, that's just, just kind of been, like, my go-to. At some point in the night, I find myself <laughs> like that. <laughs> I do typically start out on my back like this. Um, I think it's been really comfortable. I like memory foam a lot. But I will definitely continue using this. Um, I would recommend it. I mean, when I'm choosing pillows, I'm all about... Um, just comfort and being able to fall fall asleep pretty easily um, on it and this meets that criteria for me <laughs> so I'm not sure what you're looking for in a pillow um, but as far as that's concerned uh, I've been I've been happy with this um, let me go ahead and take this out of the pillowcase so you can see uh, what it looks like on the inside
Okay, so here's our zipper. So pull this out. Okay, so this is what it looks like on the inside. And that's what I was talking about. So where you're resting your head, there's actually like a hole right through the middle. Um, and on the pillowcase, there is like this hard button, both on the top and the bottom. So I was almost worried like, if that compresses all the way down, like, are you going to feel that button on the back of your head? Uh, but never once did I feel that that wasn't an issue. But yeah, so this is what the inner part looks like. So I hope you have enjoyed this review. I will leave all of the information down in the description box below if you're interested in getting one and uh, checking it out. <sighs> I like it. All right, thanks for joining me today, and I will see you next time. All right, bye.